water signs pisces cancer and scorpio welcome to my channel this is chelsea thank you so much for liking and subscribing i really appreciate your love and support um we are going to find out what is your person your love interest uh, next action towards you please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it may not resonate with each and every one of you spirits and angels please show me for water signs pisces cancer and scorpio their person your love interest um what's the next action towards water signs they're definitely longing for you and they've been thinking a lot about you they're going to travel towards you if your person lives far away from you are but also eight of wands can indicate them wanting to communicate with you surprising you with the tower here and the five pentacles at the bottom of the deck so they've been keeping quiet it feels like with the moon and the hermit unless you're the one who has been keeping really quiet like very mysterious then your person could be wondering what are you up to they could be longing for you checking up on you online with eight of wands here see what you're up to because it feels like maybe you've been really quiet or mysterious unless it is them okay if it's them uh who are kind of like keeping quiet to themselves a bit you know with the hermit here isolating that isolating themselves from you maybe i think they need time to think and reflect over this connection or over whatever that may have trans transpired between two of you nine of swords they could be overthinking over analyzing in regards to you how you feel about them with the Queen of Cups here in reverse. So they may be wondering how you feel about them, um, whether you still love them, whether if you have feelings for them, if this is someone kind of new. I'm going to start off with, for those of you separated from your person, okay? If this person you're separated from, if you're separated from this person, this person is thinking about ways to manifest you back into their life. And they are wondering whether if you still love them, if it's worth their time, their effort to do so. So they have some doubts here with the moon. And with the three of wands, they could be waiting for the right time to actually reach out to you. But they are feeling kind of pessimistic in regards of taking this action towards you because they don't know how things are going to pan out. How are you going to receive it? Uh, if you're going to reject them or are you going to be okay uh, with them? telling you something or wanting to reconcile here or even if you even want to talk or not you know it really depends where you're at right now but i feel like yeah they could be afraid that you might ignore them or reject them if they were to speak with you uh, or try to manifest you back into their life um, we've got the nine of pentacles here your person could be a virgo capcom or a taurus full of fortune in reverse we've also got the tower here they could be planning to surprise you something like a big surprise, big gesture. If this is uh, someone kind of new, they may find you to be a bit mysterious and that really attracts them, right? Eight of Wands here. They, it feels like they want to get to know you more. If this is someone new, they want to get to know you more. They want to get to know you better. They want to win your heart because the Queen of Cups here is in reverse. That means for some of you, if this is someone new, um, they haven't captured your heart yet. Or well, that they just don't really know exactly if you love them or not. They're kind of not. They're not sure with the moon here, so they they could be planning on making things happen, give, showing you big gestures or surprising you with a tower here to capture your heart, to make you like them or make you fall in love with them. But this person, it feels like they would like to offer you a commitment. They're moving very slowly though. Okay. Could be an ex, someone you separated from, or someone new. Whatever the case is, your love interest would like to offer you a commitment. But the Nine of Pentacles is a very slow energy, so they may be taking their own sweet time. Three of Wands, you're just waiting for the right moment to do so. Because Wheel of Fortune here is, in, uh, here is in reverse. Maybe there's certain things that are completely out of their control and that they can't do anything about it right now. They're feeling kind of stuck. So until they unstuck themselves, they won't come forward. Whether they're stuck in their head, <laughs> the Hermit and Nine of Swords here, or that they could be stuck in a situation or because of certain other factors, external factors, okay, or location factors. We've got the Five Pentacles here. Hmm. I, I do sense this person wanting to brave the storm with you, wanting to go through ups and downs with you. They don't mind it. 
they don't mind it at all. Bit of a sacrifice energy I'm getting here. Not sacrifice, like kind of like them wanting to really, really pursue this connection with the magician here, wanting to make it happen desperately. Okay, I'm gonna pull out a few of these oracles. Give your relationship a chance. If you are currently separated for, from your person, they may ask you for a second chance with the Wheel of Fortune here for deceiving you in the past or not being honest with themselves or with you or with their own feelings or with the situation. can be anything. may not always mean lying and cheating. It could be that for some of you. Worth waiting for. So they're waiting for you. And see, waiting for the right moment to reach out to you, to talk to you. To maybe with a tower here surprise you with something. Keep an open mind. Let your friends help you. They could also be planning something with your mutual friends or family to try and surprise you. They could be asking questions as well in regards to you with your mutual friends or just them just spying on you online with eight of wands here. It is safe for you to love. I sense them wanting to take actions towards you next by con convincing you that it is safe for you to love them, that they can be trusted, like the Nine of Pentacles here, that they are serious now and that they're committed. Or if this is also someone new, they may want to convince you that you know it's safe for you to put your guards down and love them. Yeah. Hmm. They may want you to forgive them if this is someone you're separated from or if they go if both of you are going through some issues. But I feel like generally water signs, again, if you're separated from this person, your person's next actions towards you will be wanting to ask for a second chance or wanting to ask for forgiveness or telling you that they would like to forgive you for something that may have happened in the past here. Again, roles can be reversed between you two, right? I'm going to pull up a few more cards here. Hmm. Right now with the Seven of Wands here, it feels like, yeah, they would like to defend this connection. Their next action towards you will be them wanting to defend this connection, defend themselves. Um... I feel a bit like them also trying to manipulate you a little bit. Yeah, because we've got the deception card and the magician here. They may, their next action towards you may be manipulating you into thinking that it's not all of their fault. It could also be your fault. Right now, I see them not taking any actions, but they're, they're waiting for the right time. They're moving very, very, very slowly, okay? Or that they could be waiting for you to put your guards down first before they reach out to you and speak with you. All right, what are signs, Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio? This is your reading. Hope you resonated. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm open for personal readings. If you'd like to book me, my information is in the description box below. I'll leave you with two playlists on the screen right now. The first one is from my second channel. It's a travel vlog channel. Check it out if you want to. Second playlist is from this channel. It has all of the readings that I've done for you and for the rest of the signs for different topics, different questions. But all of these re readings are still valid. They're still relevant because I post them almost every single day. Take care, water signs. Hope to see you back here again soon. Bye.